my back, yo Like flex on you haters uh, uh, High haters yeah. This is my world, so it's all in my favor yeah. I like all girls, yeah, all type of flavors But that don't matter, cause I just got my baby Sight. Pull up right there in Mercedes Oh, I don't wanna like the Navy uh, For that girl to the sun, done number one Like I'm a great that one What's up, Back Nation? This is your boy OG, and I'm back with another NBA 2K17 Best Build tutorial. So, we did the point guard build yesterday. Now, today we are dropping the shooting guard build. Now, first things first, little disclaimer out there. I'm not telling you guys what's the best build to pick. I am trying to give you guys, I'm trying to lead you guys to the water so you guys can drink. And what I'm basically saying is I'm just showing you guys the all the ups and downs of each build and what you can do and also give you an example of how he will play so you guys can figure out what's the best for you. Now I will be releasing what I think is the best build for everyone but that's going to be strictly off of my opinion and off my play style alright. So this build will be based off a 6-6 shooting guard so like I said before in the last video the height the width the weight does matter so if you got your man taller than mine his attributes should be a little bit different if his longs a little bit longer than mine it would be a little bit different and if the guy weighs more it would be a little bit different all right so we're gonna jump straight into this man so let's find the archetypes so the first one we get into is Lockdown Defender. Now this guy will best resemble a guy I know and we all know well, Tony Allen. He is not the best shooter. He won't be even the best driver or even the best dunker. This guy uh, excels at defense. His steal will be a 94. Defense consistency will be a 94. And all ball defense will be a 94. And if you slap a plus 5 boost to all that, that all will enter a 99 range. So the badges he will get is defensive stopper, pick dodger, pick pocketer, chase down artist, and charge card. Now this guy will be a goon on defense. He is the ultimate strap. So if you want to be the strap king, this is what you pick. Next up on the list is a playmaker build. This guy will best resemble Victor Oladipo. Now, the first thing is to point out is this guy's speed with the ball will be a 94. Like, that is ridiculous. A 94, you slap a boost to it, that's a 99 speed with ball. This guy will be able to play the two guard role where he'd be able to go from the shooting guard position to the point guard position if needed. So if you have one of those guys who like to just dribble up the court and be in control of the game, but also be tall with it, this is the player for you. He'll be able to guard almost from point guards to about the small forward position if you have a decent tall height as in I do as in 6'6". Six, six. Right? So this guy will be great with dribbling the ball. The slasher build will best resemble DeMar DeRozan. Now this guy is coming in and dunking on anybody. Now his driving dunk will be a 93. You put a plus five on that, that is a what? 98. Contact dunk is a 90. Now this guy also has pretty good mid-range stats. Now this guy will not be relied upon on to shoot any type of threes. He will still have a good speed of 85 and speed with the ball will be a 76. But remember, when you slapping them boosters on it, that speed will go up to a 90 and the speed with the ball will go up to an 81, which is good. So this guy is definitely made for dunking and pulling up mid-range jumper on people. So this will be a great balance player right here. He won't be able to shoot near three. So if you want to shoot threes, this ain't the build for you. In my opinion, this may be one of the best builds to make for a shooting guard besides sharp shooter. So if you want to be able to handle the ball, be able to shoot off the dribble, and have a nice decent mid-range and a decent three, this is the guy for you, all right? You will be able to have a driving layup of an 83, standing layup of an 85, a shot off the dribble three will be a 90, shot off the dribble mid will be a 90, all right? Contested and open three will be a 70. You slap a boost on that, that's a 75. Your mid range will be a 79. Slap a boost on that, that will be a 84. So this guy will give you the whole arsenal of offense. If you want to be an offensive goon and be able to just score at will and tirelessly, 
Speaking of tirelessly, the badges he, they will have with tireless score, it will be mid-range dead eye, and also another special one that you need is difficult shots. The sharpshooter build is based off the one and only Clay Thompson with both mid-range and three-point shooting maxed out you would get a 91 3 slap a boost on that that is a 96 3 and a 96 mid because they both are the same now the only thing in question will be your attacking the rack attributes your driving layup will be a 69 uh, your speed will only be a 74, but your ball control will be a 76. Now remember, plus 5 boost out there, I gotta keep emphasizing that. That makes this guy look a little bit better. So you see the badges, this guy will excel at shooting nothing but deep threes. But if you slap the right boosters on this guy, this guy can also be a great ball handler that will give you an added point guard with deep and deadly range and his mid range will be bar none now to me this may be the best shooting guard build by far this may even be the best build by far because he can be 6'6 and he'd be able to shoot lights out so that is the video for today hope you guys find some of this stuff very educational hopefully you guys are actually learning a little something about what you guys want to make Alright, so a lot of guys are out here telling you what's the best build. It's impossible to know now because nobody has the game. Nobody is really playing the game or even playing at the park. So I'm just trying to help you guys get a baseline of what you guys want to do and what basically the baseline of what these archetypes are and how they will perform on the court if you use them wisely, right? So n tomorrow. The small four archetypes will be coming out. So all you big LeBron KD fans out there, bro, I got something special for you guys tomorrow. So tune in tomorrow as your boy OG is about to be out. So go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe. Share the video. Help somebody else out. Get those guys better too. So it's your boy and I'm out. Peace. He got me not wanting to try anymore. All of the fussing and fighting is stressing me out, man, I can't even write anymore You know you don't care like you used to when you get caught up and you don't even lie anymore Man, love should be like a drug, it's kinda fucked up when it don't get you high anymore Who the fuck is on my side anymore? What's the purpose in life anymore? Rhetorical questions that don't have an answer, my brain overloaded, can't sleep through the night anymore